once more with feeling. Lita? I want to go up there and end this myself. But I just feel like I don't have the stomach for it anymore. Some people can run on vengeance forever, but not you. You're a leader. A hero. Just like Lars. And you? I'm not going up there for vengeance. What are you going up there for? I'm just cleaning up a mess. Oh, hmm. wow. That's... I forgot he said that line and I love it. The yep. roadie's job... That's my job. ...is to clean up the mess. Bye, Eddie. Yeah, I think Lita's going to be, like, the leader of the new free people. Yes. How do we stop this, Ophelia? One of us has to die. Okay. I nominate the person who sold us out to the demons. You're right. Better you than me. Please, do not stop. You two have been having such an entertaining war. I see you called in your boyfriend for help. A eh, Sicoria? No, I... Wait. Sicoria? Sicoria? This girl? This sad human girl? <laughs> oh, you think she is the grand demon witch? The white-winged death? <laughs> this soggy puppet couldn't hold a candle to Emperor Sakoria. The Emperor was our most fierce, our most bloodthirsty warrior. Oh, I'll admit I was pleased when she left our time, her throne unattended. But when she did not return, I mourned for her. I thought she had failed. What are you talking about? She did fail. My father killed her, right? She's never coming back. <laughs> That's not um, exactly what your father did yeah. to her. Yeah. The road can be a lonely place, don't you think? No, she succeeded in sending us a great wealth of secrets. Not from the future, but from our past. Through the vessel of her own child thank you son of sakoria for completing your mother's mission for teaching us the secrets of the titans and ensuring our rule over this land forever but you said that i smelled her blood in the temple i did just as i can smell it now <laughs> coursing through your veins but like, no way. Do you think I'm Imagine secure? It? What? When I found out it was just you and not Sakoria back to fight me for the throne. Okay, that checks out. Why are you acting so surprised? You're wearing her shirt. You're wielding her axe. No, we may finally crush this Black Tear rebellion forever. Starting like we did the last time. Oh. By tearing out. It's hard. Oh. Ophelia! So yeah, you've been wearing Sicoria's shirt this whole time. Okay. Her merchandise. He put the heart in his chest with his oh, heart. Please. That was nothing compared to what you did. To her. You made her into a little monster. Now let me show you how to make a big one. Oh. <laughs> that is the craziest guitar I've ever seen. Yep. I, I don't believe he's playing that with only two hands. I mean, Black Magic. Yeah. What was I saying last time? Black Magic Woman? And now that woman's heart isn't him? We got one last field mission, dude. Okay.
I knew Eddie's mom must be a demon. I didn't think she would be Sicoria. I mean, they kind of lead you to believe Ophelia Sicoria and that he's talking to Ophelia back there. How'd it go? <laughs> Damn it, Mangus! Oh no. He's shooting up the earth. Mangus, get back on the board. Okay, one last mission, dude. Okay, so now we get to fight all those tainted coral enemies we've been seeing around. Yep. Good luck. Alright, guys. Yeah, get some immediate units out here. I don't think good. any of the, Yeah, not enough of them were close enough. Still, you got some good stuff out here. Um, okay, so... Okay. Um, I suggest using an anvil right now, just so they don't- just so they can't summon anything yet. An anvil? Where? Um, your song. Oh, I thought he had to be... I thought he had to be around for me to do that. Okay, maybe I misunderstood how that works. Okay, I think you're good. Yeah, get some, uh... Oh, yeah, you gotta get rid of these things. Oh, they just, like, drop more enemies. Yeah, you need to get control, so, like, when you get an opportunity, get those... Yeah, get some more, uh... Uh, get some more uh, fans out here. <laughs> okay, we're gonna fan tribute. And... Um, Alright. Target that one. Bring me their hand. Take no prisoner. Once it's done. There you go. So they may come to love us. <laughs> Davinculus's band sucks. Making fans <laughs> of our band. Oh god, look at that merch booth. Alright, get some big units out here when you can. Man, I bet that sells some really cool merch though. No fooling. Alright, see if you can use a face melter on them. Uh, yeah. Oh god, yeah. There, Tabiculus is there. Okay. Wanted to finish yeah. that song first. Uh, to your uh, right. Oh, he was here. Uh, I guess he flew off. All right, good. There he is. Okay, good. You got him off. Once uh, you clear this area, get some, uh, uh, get a fan tribute going. Good, good. And then... Yep. That's a uh, Tim Curry doing the voice of Ridiculous, by the way. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, Tim Curry is a great villain voice. Oh, absolutely. Go get him! Destroy! Okay, so... Uh, get some Fire Barons out here. Fire Barons, sounds good. Okay, so, whoa, heads. Oh, okay, so, yeah, um, target the heads with a beacon, I think? Find the beacon and get yourselves there. Okay, there they go. Yeah, good. I think they got too far away from me. <laughs> Bet you wish you wore a bib, because now you got face all over your shirt. Uh, um, okay. I suggest, like, waiting for Rock Crushers, or upgrading your, uh, main units. Good. Okay, okay, okay. 
Nice, nice. Oh, they took oh, down the. Geez, they took down ridiculous. one of the. They took one of them down. Absolute monster. Oh God. Good. One of them's down. Awesome. Time to summon a deuce. Okay. What's this? Get up, you. Uh, yeah. Summon the deuce. Okay, get up there. Okay, before I do that, I want to, uh... Get behind me and look um... Not that one, not that one. To the, to the I, right. I know, I want to put the beacon on that one. Though, oh, so okay, okay, okay. That while I'm... You gotta hurry, by the way. I don't think it's gonna stay dead for oh, long. Okay. Okay. Uh, to the left, to the left, to the left. The entrance is no. all the way back there. That. I thought it would... J j just trust me, go back, go back. Oh. Yeah, you see? All right, entrance is all the way up there. Oh, weird. Shoot. Um. Yeah, you can you can worry about re re regaining control later. Just focus on this. Okay. <laughs> the turn is really tight, too. Okay. There it All is. Right. Cool. Okay. That wasn't for Ophelia. You know, I'm glad now that your mother refused my advances all those years ago. Because at least I know you're not my son. There aren't many who can say that. Oh, <laughs> what? All right, get some more units out here. Uh... Uh, I think he's summoning way more units now, though. Take no prisoners. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, he, he starts getting desperate. Uh, face Melter, right here. Yeah, baby. Oh, he took down one of my towers. Um, if you can get over there and uh, use a uh, bring it on home, you should be able to get some field control more. Hopefully they don't kill you before you can do it! Nice! Okay, I wish I knew how messed up this would get when I killed the first one, because then I would have waited in a, until I had more upgrades. Okay, just, just like, take... Take the time to get some field control going. Field control? They are smashing me to pieces. Yeah. <laughs> oh, get rid of him. Get rid of him. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know about field control, dude. They, they are oh, systematically he's destroying all my... Oh, it just, like, stands there. Jesus! I do not know how to regain field control from this. Yeah, if I had known, I would have, like, made sure I had, like, units upgraded before I destroyed that first head. Yeah, I admittedly did not know this was gonna happen. You got the call of the wild off, at least. As long as they don't destroy your um, stage, you should be good. Yeah, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get my... Okay, good, he's down. That one's down. Look, he's he's taking all of my fan towers. Take out the big ones first, and then you can focus on regaining those. I suggest getting some, uh, some, uh, kill masters out here when you can. Gotta wait for it to cool down. Oh gosh. Oh man. Um, yeah, this has gone completely pear shaped. Oh gosh. She is summoning things faster than I can. Like I don't I don't have any other units now. 
I'm not getting enough fans to to take them back. Oh my I, I, god! I can't get a solo off. Yeah, Holy I um, crap. I think we're gonna have to take another crack at this. But what the fuck? Where? How did all this happen? He, he just went ballistic when I took out the first head, and I like wasn't ready for it to go ballistic. I didn't have. I like, guess you gotta like build up your army first before doing that. Yeah, yeah. Oh my lord! See if you can take out Dibiculus at least. The, these. These Morningstar guys yeah. are terrible. It's also weird because, like, except for, like, driving around Gracehenge... Maybe you can, like, salvage it by using a Bring It On Home, like, right in the middle of your own stage. Um, if I can be alive for more than two seconds. Yeah, no, that's... Yeah. Well. Ooh, un unique, uh, unique defeat you animation. Know, you have your mother's eyes. And soon, so shall I. On a necklace, I think. That's a very good wing quote. <laughs> Makes me wonder if all the other, like, big matches had things like that. Okay, so I guess, like, in this situation... Build up your army first, get yeah. as many of the big guys as you can, and then go for the heads. Jesus Christ, that's a lot! Wait. Okay, yeah. yeah, you got it, you got it, you got it. The, the beacon system is weird to me sometimes. Yeah, upgrade your stage as much as you can, and upgrade your units, and then we'll go for the heads. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm starting to understand. The good thing is, like, one, they'll be able to take down those leeches, and then you can just go after these guys. <laughs> Super effective. Take no this isn't Pokemon, Eddie. Get behind me and look alert. Take some ass. All right, if you can just get some control here, nice. Go for it. What you can? Oh, you know, you know something you can do is if you can take down the both both heads like simultaneously and then go one for one right after another. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. Yeah, because hopefully they don't, like, get back up eventually like we were thinking. Yeah. Maybe I suggest back. upgrading them first. Um, get that over with. I need to upgrade the stage more before I can upgrade Oh, ah, okay. Them. You're getting attacked, by the way. <laughs> yeah, because the heads can, like, spit these globules that, like, summon enemies wherever they damn well please. Yeah. We need to attack the side! Um, okay, where are all the guys I'm summoning? Not enough fans. Um, okay, so here is where I will tell everybody to wait. Alright. Oh, wow, they got one already. Oh, okay. You don't have to attack it now. Yeah, I didn't even tell them to do that. What's this? Get up, you. Wait for your fans. Unlocks advanced what? iron head technology. Hey, when does head. this I'm okay. not so sure it's dead? I think what'll happen is like okay, so here's the thing. I might as well warn you about this now. Okay. I think our main plan is to take down both heads simultaneously, go on the deuce one after another. Like basically once you got get on the deuce, you're not getting off. Yeah. Because after you take down both heads, you gotta drive the deuce into the cathedral. I, I was thinking there would be something like that. Mm -hmm. when did I get so off? There we go. Yeah, build up just in case. <laughs> okay, that's... They're fighting those guys. They, they Do you want to help them? Guys. No, they're fine. All right, yeah. This is a, this is one of those situations where you gotta have like gotta turtle up a bit. 
Yeah. How many fans do you need for the upgrade? Uh, I'll know in a second. I think a boss pimp would really stir things up. Okay, I need 200 for that. And there you go. Don't let anyone near our merchandise. <laughs> nice. Take no prisoners. That's crazy how they just kind of went and took out that one head on their own accords. The thing is, like, the head's not coming back. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Get a Call of the Wild going. Might as well get some animals out here. Yeah. I almost messed up the song that time. Okay, um... How many do you need for the stage upgrade? 350. Oh, this is level 4. Yeah. That probably lets you upgrade these. Okay, so we're really turtling here. All right, help him out. Might as well. Yeah, I'll, I'll kill some things in the meantime. Man, remember, like, way back episode one when we were, like, driving the deuce around these things? Yeah. All right, that's number two. Okay, it's down again. No, not you two. I got you with a smart one. <laughs> down again. Okay, let me go finish it off. Okay, I'm gonna let them keep, like, fighting mm -hmm. dudes there. Yeah, keep fighting and rebuilding, and just do what you gotta. 40, 46. 50. There. Okay, so this is gonna be a bit of a slog, then, because we're just gonna wait for... I'm just gonna wait for a lot of fans. Yep. Oh, oh, I got restrained. He did the restraining. Okay, I am out of troops, so I should make some more. Yeah, definitely. Okay, the uh, stage is upgraded. Good. Yeah, right now I think it's best just to, like, build up your army just in case things go south. Yeah. Um... <laughs> It doesn't look like the heads are coming back, actually, so yeah, you might just be able to do this at your leisure. Nice. I remember these spear things. Oh, yeah. The, this is from when we were um, escorting Lars. All right, your headbangers are coming in. Good. All right. Yeah, upgrade. Yeah. Okay, it still doesn't look like I can upgrade. Anybody yeah. So else. right now, just make sure to just uh, get uh, your army built up, and then once it's built up, they'll be able to defend uh, defend the situation long enough for you to uh, do what yeah. you need to want to do. Okay. Cool. Uh, get some of these. Yeah. Get some kill masters out here. I'm gonna summon the deuce while I'm waiting. Oh boy, oh boy. I would suggest doing an anvil, a rising sun, and a uh and uh a a uh, rock block before going up to the heads. Okay. Just to make sure that everything is all set like is all situated. Are you attacking? Oh the Viculus himself. Alright, good. Get some more army get some more units out here. Okay, I'm I suggest head I suggest headbangers. Or actually yeah, headbangers, and then go for some of the bigger ones. Okay, we're really uh, bullying Daviculus now. Yeah, get this guy out of here. Beautiful. Yeah, it's nice to see that the quill spikes uh, do that effect with the uh, with the um, with the explosion. Yeah, if we can get at least one rock crusher 
and then like fill up the rest with whatever other units you want and then we can start doing our game plan yeah how many do you need for a rock crusher 450. Man, it's sensory overload when, like, you're surrounded by yeah, everything. Oh my god. <laughs> Good stuff. Couldn't even see myself. There's a mammoth standing over me. Okay, your, uh, your hexadon is down, so next time you can do Call of the Wild, go for it. Okay, you need 450 for the Rock Crusher. That's a lot. I don't know if we. I don't know if the rock crusher is the right way to go. It's basically just a mortar cannon. Go for an impaler then. There's room up here for two. Okay. Um. Yeah, the heads are still down. So you know what? If, if they're gonna stay down, then you can just basically do what you need to. I do really like just watching them murder things here. Yeah. Okay. Do you think we're gonna go? Do you think we're good to go for it now? Or do you want to fill up your army first? Maybe we should get up to forty first just to be safe. All right. Get some razor girls. Razor girls. That's yeah. Razor girls are just idea. useful overall. Defend our merch shows over that way. Chill for a sec. Yeah, this mission you kind of have to like utilize, like go about very, very differently. I guess so. Kill them all! Oh. <laughs> Rock can heal, but sometimes it hurts. <laughs> uh, more headbangers. Headbangers. Uh, which one is a uh, load of three? Uh. Killmasters. Uh, um, okay, I suggest waiting for roadies. Okay, that's two hundred. Uh -huh. that. That's fine. You got your army built up. You should. They should be able to defend the situation for you to do your thing. Thirty, thirty-six, forty-two, forty-four. <laughs> I'm gonna start. Uh, yeah, let's let's uh, start getting up. things going. Oh. Uh, What's that, uh, yeah, Anvil of Burden. Uh, what's the one next to, um, the, uh, Battle Cry? Uh, you mean the, um, the Morning? No, not the other one. Rally Army. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, your... uh, okay, so it summons up to your location. Okay, that would have been useful before, actually. Yeah, okay. Get roadies? Okay. Alright, before you do, before you do, Rising Sun. Why, 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 why? All right. Let's do it. All right. Yeah, I just need them to, like, hold out, I guess. Yeah, just have them defend, and they'll uh, handle whatever, the, whatever comes about. Basically, ignore everything from here on out and just focus on getting these heads out. How fitting that after everything we've gone through in this Let's Play... It's coming down to my ability to drive without hitting things. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. And then go straight for the other one. Yeah. Whew. Okay. Alright. 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 Yes, you're very angry. I, I, I know. You know, I'm glad that your mother refused my advances all It might be because I'm a gross, pointy man. No, you're not my son. There aren't many who can say that. All right, now go straight for the other one. Uh, yeah. Like, just ignore everything else. Go straight for the other one. Let Whoa. your army, let, let your army hold this off. I will let the bodies hit the floor. Yep, just, just go for it. Because there's not really much it can do. They're just gonna be. They're just gonna overwhelm you, like, like, uh, at this point. So, it's all about speed now. All right, Fleetus, you've uh, you're uh, helping us out one last time here, man. <gasps> the head got back up. Okay, t at, tell him to attack it. Uh, 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 um. 
Um, where, where's my beacon button? Um, it's already on. It's already on. What the fuck? The light marks the spot. Go. Okay, there you go. You got it. You got it. They're going. They're going. They're going. Okay. Summit, like summon some more units. Get a rock crusher out here. You got a lot more. You got a lot more. They, like, Dibiculus hasn't summoned any big guys yet. Yeah, that's weird. I'm not gonna complain. You could be planted anywhere, or I might be carrying it. Oh, the head got back up when let, I let, killed let, the other one. They got one. it, they got it, they got it. Okay. Okay, so. Oh, I was, go, able, to, go. I was able to bring up my song sheet during the... Yeah, that's weird. I like you with a smart one. Okay, let me go finish it off. Okay, okay, okay. All right, here we go. And in we go. You? I'll give it up. Whatever victories your demon blood grants you will soon be unraveled by your human weakness. Come and see me when you grow a pair as big as your mother's. Deviculus has very advanced your mama jokes. talking about horns. All right, now just drive up to the cathedral. Ignore everything else. I didn't know that the last time, and I just let it happen, <laughs> and he eventually overwhelmed me. So, I had to learn that one the hard way. Oh, what you doing up there? Son of Sakoria, suckled by the dry teat of man. You are half so many things, I doubt any part of you is whole. Is there even a word for a Creature such as you. A roadie. Yeah, I'm a roadie. Yep. I keep the trash off the stage. Final boss time. Oh, here he comes. Oh, that's the spirit. Okay. Good effort, human. How do I dodge roll? Yeah. I remember how to guard. Pitiful beings. Okay. Good oh, thing you have regenerating health. Yeah. Oh, okay, you're up here now. Face melter, face melter. Good. Uh, Do we get them all? All right. Uh, I think you can uh, shock them. Yeah, there you go. Okay, cool. All right, and keep using uh, your guitar. You keep using Clementine on uh, on Dibiculus. Yeah, there you go. Uh, I watched you create that creature. It didn't take very long. I guess you've been like gestating it under the water. Okay, keep going, keep going. Yes. Oh wow, the quills also help in damaging yeah. him too. Yeah, because um. Because of the explosion. They explode and hit other enemies. Okay, let's um use that to advantage. Oof. That was one of my children. Okay, these recover are, your health these a bit. Are all your children? <laughs> running, 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 running. Good. Okay, he's up here again now. All right, face melter. Okay. Yeah, baby. The, the mobs are getting more frequent now, I think. Oh no, he's got. Yeah, watch the chains. Watch yeah, the chains. Don't, don't stand where the chains are. Okay. Do not cling to me. Silence. Oh, that's cool. How he guarded behind his back. Yeah. 
that far. Okay, recover for a bit. Okay. All right, enemy tracking, enemy tracking. I really like this theme, by the way. This is a good one. You only make me stronger. Yeah, I'm gonna get Okay, face melter? Uh, don't have it yet. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> and there's more uh, craziness happening on the stage now. Oh my god. Okay, I need to try and, like, multitask so that I can fight these guys while I fight Diviculus. Okay. Watch that arm, like, by the windows, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying not to get too close up to the walls. Okay, you're doing good. You're doing good. You're doing good. I don't want to burn my fingers off. Okay. Hit the cultists. Do a ground shaker and then face melter. Um. Uh, no, face melter yeah, is too not, risky. Not enough of them now. Good, to good, 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 good. Oh! Decapitation! <laughs> I believe that Diviculus could have survived without his head. It was Jack Black screaming at him that killed him. <laughs> I love the fact that he had to, like, okay, that's not it. This is the one I want. Uh, Sea of Black Tears. Yeah, I feel like you aren't supposed to be in there. Oh no, it's the end of Disney's Hercules. Oh, he's gonna try and return the heart to Ophelia. No, that wasn't the real you. Okay, so the Sea of Black Tears made, like, an evil goth copy of her when she jumped in, I guess. I'm gonna go with that. Oh. Jack Black, no. You need to play Bowser in an animated movie. Oh, God. That is a very strong lanyard. It is made from the veins of Ormagodin. And hey, dream come true. Got the girl. <laughs> same dr same as his dream, except the background is way cooler. Way more metal. <laughs> Whew! We did it, guys. Hot damn. I don't mind doing longer episodes for finales. <laughs> And hey, it's party time! Yeah! Tonight, we are here to celebrate a great man. A true hero. Who fought by our side. Who led us to freedom. Who believed in us when no one else did. A man who should never be, who will never be, forgotten. Lars. Ha! <laughs> When Lars Halford fell, the cause seemed lost. But it survived. Because there was another great warrior in our midst. Lita. Let us not forget the sacrifice and bravery of Lita Halford, everybody. Um, <clears throat> my brother saw goodness in people. Even in people for whom I had nothing but suspicion. Now I hope that we can stand together. I hope we can all stand together. For the honor of Bladehenge, for the freedom of its people, and for the glory of its metal!
Who's the one burly guy back there? I think he's one of the roadies. Okay. Yeah, I figured as a roadie, Eddie's not going to take the glory. Nope. Hey, man. You're missing the party. Oh, uh, yeah. You know, I'm more comfortable back here. Yeah. Oh, here. I got something for you. Aw, oh, man, guess you didn't have to get me. Hey, wait. This is my tour book. <laughs> yeah, I swiped it. And it seems you wrote on it. Well, I wanted to leave you a little note, and then some of the other guys wanted to sign it for you. Don't forget about us, man. Dudes, I'm not going away. I just got a couple errands to run. I'll be right back. You better. I'm not doing the loadout by myself. You don't have to do the loadout at all. We're staying here for good. The tour is over? Yeah, man. The tour is over. We're home now. Good roadie knows his whole job is to make someone else look good, keep someone else safe, help someone else do what they were put here to do. A good roadie stays out of the spotlight. If he's doing his job right, he don't even know he's there. Once in a while, he might step on stage just to fix a problem, to set something right. But then before you even realize he was there, or what he did, he's gone. She's got black tear tears. I mean, at the end of the day, she's still... She was still there. Yeah. Brutal legend, everybody! Brutal legend! Woo! So, there you have it. Um, Jack Black's love letter, as well as Double Fine's love letter to heavy metal, rock, and whatever else you want. And look at that, there's a... Like... Uh, you can actually see, yeah, like, a lot of the cast of Brutal Legend. There's Tim Curry. They, they use their likenesses in the game. Yeah. Like, even down to the Killmaster himself. Uh, there's the Hunter. Yep, there's the Hunter. Yeah, like, as a matter of fact, it seems like a lot of the characters in this game are modeled after real people. Yeah. So, there you have it, man. Uh, the designers. and Yeah, I like when they do stuff like this. Uh-huh. All right, uh, any final thoughts on Brutal Legend before we put this to bed? It is a jank game. Like, that, that, like, let's be real for a moment, guys. This is a jank game. <laughs> it is rough around the edges, but it is one of the most heartfelt, one of the most creative, and just downright charming games that you'll ever get your hands on. Like, it, this is one of those examples of a game where it just shows you don't have to have the greatest graphics, you don't have to gr have the greatest gameplay or the greatest whatever to make a good game. Like, this game didn't do well in the markets, not by any stretch, but, like, it's gained a cold following, like, thanks to just kind of, like, people discovering it slowly and then other people discovering it through cultural osmosis. But this is a game with a lot of heart, and I and I really appreciate that. How about you? It makes me think of a quote from... I forget what um, Broadway show this comes from, uh, but the quote is, I'd rather be... I'd, I'd rather be nine people's favorite thing than a hundred people's ninth favorite thing. Yeah. Where I feel like they made this for such a, like, narrow demographic, and, like, you know, it was it, it, it was kind of popular when it originally came out. Um, but, le like, this is the definition of a cult classic. Where Absolutely. There, are, there Absolutely. are, you know... 15 years later or however however long it's been like not everybody remembers brutal legend but those who do and those who liked it are like they really like it they're like fuck yeah brutal legend and yeah. i can i can see why it has that same kind of feeling as psychonauts for it where it just like feels so much like what the creators intended it to be uh-huh that even if it like falls short in certain areas if like the mission if if there aren't enough side quests that you end up doing a bunch of hunter missions at the end and it's annoying. Yeah, like, and that's it's the thing. It's like, like, whatever. The, even the annoying things about this game is like, you know, oh, like, this is just something else, like, that's, like, fun to talk about when it comes to this game. Um, because, uh, yeah, it's kind of like how you put it. 
um, anytime you talk to someone and they know, like, if they don't know Brutal Legend, then that's a, that's an opportunity to, like, you know, have them discover the game. And those who know Brutal Legend are like, oh, yeah, that game's awesome. Yeah. It's weird, like, it's janky, and it's, like, it's got a few things wrong with it, but I don't care. This game's awesome. It, it does really feel like, at the beginning, in the, in the intro full motion video when Jack Black takes the album out of the shelf where he's like, oh, you gotta find it. It's this really obscure thing and, like, it's just, it's so special. I didn't want to try and own it for myself because it, it's like that. This game feels like this weird album you found that nobody's heard of, but it's awesome. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, all in all, like, I really, really enjoy this game. It's not the greatest game in the world, not by any stretch, but you know what? It's awesome. It's awesome. Good timing with the music end there. <laughs> so, um, we already know what our next thing is going to be here on this channel. We're pretty excited for it. Oh, man. I I'm kind of scared about it, too. I'm going to be honest. Yeah. Oh, right. Ridiculous has now been that defeated. That business is over. Just a couple other loose ends I'd like to tie up. So, yeah. Uh, the general idea here is that now that Ridiculous is defeated, um, you can now basically... You're basically just free to roam around the entire map, discover, like... Any treasures you miss, any side quests that you feel like doing. There's one more Iron Head sneak attack that apparently we missed. Yeah, apparently. Um, and yeah, the 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 air, the world is basically your oyster. Now. Yeah, if you want to try and like a hundo percent this, I do not. Yeah. <laughs> um, but um, I, I am curious about one thing though. Like what like what happens if you go back to Bladehenge? Uh, which part is Bladehenge? Is this? Oh uh, no, it's down there. This. Uh, the, the sword. Yeah, the sword, okay. Yeah, because, like, I'm actually curious as to what happens if you go back to Bladehenge. Because, like, I've never actually done, done any explore, exploration after the fact. Hang on, like, go back to the map real quick. Put your cursing on, on that big one. The star. Brutal campaign complete. Diviculus is defeated the land... Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> the, the beacon is that there is no beacon. Whoa! That is that is the first time I've ever been knocked out of my car from a fall before. Okay, let's get back to Bladehenge. Yeah. Uh. So like, uh, I, I'm just curious if like there are still people there, like after you've uh, after you've like finished everything, you know? Yeah. Am I? Yeah. I'm kind of cut. Yeah. Just keep going forward. It'd be amazing if I found the yeah, last. Yeah, like there, there are still like you know some leftover like you know bits of the faction, like some still loose ends of like you know. I would have liked to find the last of the lore, but that's okay. Yeah. Yep, uh, there it is. Good old blade hedge. And I'm gonna run up here. Yeah, because I don't know if, like, everyone's back or not. No. It's kind of, like, in the same state that it was at the end game, I think. Yeah, yeah it seems like it. Doesn't Where'd like everybody it. go? Um, they're probably still, like, waiting outside the final area. That would have been that would have been a neat thing if they like had a end game state where people were like back around here. Yeah, that, that that's what but... I'm that's what I'm wondering is like where everybody else is. But I think uh, I think what the general idea is that like they situated themselves somewhere off the map, and now it's just Eddie like tying up any loose ends before heading back to uh, yeah the faction because they don't want to. Um... The idea is that it's like left ambiguous where he stands with Ophelia and stuff like that, and they don't want to ruin that. I guess. Yeah, sounds good to me. All right, man. So, shall we uh, take it away? Yeah, until the next project. I'm the Comic Foil. I'm the Green Scorpion. This has been Brutal Legend, and um, yeah, stay metal, everybody. Amen to that. That feels very, like, disingenuous coming from me. I'm, like, such not a metal person. But, you know, I think I became a little bit more metal from this playthrough. I mean, like, at the very least, like, have you discovered a sort of, like, greater appreciation for metal after uh, doing this playthrough? Yeah, I didn't, like, dislike it ever or anything, but, yeah, I do feel... I, I do feel like my appreciation slightly improved. Hey, wait a second, is that where they are? Uh... No. 
Okay, just like I, I just really want to I just really want to know if anyone's like still around at all or something. Oh, it's the Ironhead sneak attack. That's why. Yeah. All right. Part of me wants to do the last Ironhead sneak attack. I mean, Hi. it's right. It's right there. Wait, where, where, where are you? To the right. Do I just talk to you? Oh. oh, I didn't see that guy in there. Is this gonna be like a super hard one? Hey, who we ambushing? Bad guys. Want to help? Uh, it's good to see some things Let's never change. Let's make this an ambush for the ages. Like, did they really just add this at the end of it all? I don't know. This is gonna be a one. Oh, and hey, it's um. Oh my God! It's the Vic. It's it's like freaking it's what's White. it? It's Lion White's guys. What? Okay, so it was a super. Maybe I just hadn't done that one before the Lion White's arc ended. Yeah, I must have just. Was that like just the leftover one from? Yeah, and I think like, it, I think it went away after we defeated Lion White. So like it's just a leftover like you know sneak attack that yeah. we didn't do. Okay, sure. See you guys next time. Woo. <laughs> Weird way to end it, but all right. <laughs> what What do you want me to do? I don't know. <laughs> there's no, almost, not not you. Just the sneak attack. There's nothing left. <laughs>